fire me if I don't meet my certain goals. If they can't fire me for not wearing a pink shirt on Tuesday, okay? They can't fire me because I was scheduled. Because you make too much. <laughs> <laughs> they can't hire, in my district, with the cuts that are coming, we're going to lose at least another four teachers. You know, you know, you know that we I know, we can't, all our, all our small schools can't afford we're to lose a teacher. We won't even be accredited because we won't have a broad enough curriculum to even be accredited. I understand that. That's not the problem. The problem is we have no money. The problem with the union isn't the money part of it. No, I agree with that. But the problem with the union is, is uh, 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 transparency, it's accountability. It's told you. It's, see, see, okay. okay. You know, hey, I have my whole lifetime of experience. It's like you feel well, you but do. But we're saying things have changed. I mean, I understand. They've changed they some. I, I agree. They, they, they are getting a little, a little better. Unionism, just by its nature, protects everybody up to a minimum standard. Will you argue against that, or that position? I think that unionism brings people together united. Right, okay, but my point, this point, you're protected up to a minimum standard. Is that not I correct? Don't think teaching we oh, well, it's can, we can't talk then, because you're not yes. realistic. No, but if, we, if, I, I no. if we don't have that security, you will not have that minimum standard. Educational. I think the standard will be way higher, so well, we're not going to agree. Right. So we're not going to agree. He's not a reality. <laughs> and you, you and you, you, have, you can replace me. I don't have tenure. You can get rid of me next to the I have a feeling that'll happen. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have a little toy here. Thank you. 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 Because everybody else does, all through our society. That's a free society. That's the difference between a free society and a communist society. For 17, 20 years. Those people stay with those jobs for one or two years. And I think that's well, I don't want this to feel like it's an attack. I don't mean no, I know. I no, I respect you guys have your opinions. And I, I hope you respect mine. And I, and I told you, I'm not a politician. I'm being up front with But I would really appreciate it if you came to our schools and saw <laughs> I, I have. I've been to have many of the schools. Oh, so, yeah. I've been there. I've been to Camia. I've been to McCall. I've been or it's pretty close to my own school because my kids teach there. Well, and in my school district, the union solves as many problems for the for our school board and for our administration. Of we have this teacher over here; she's unrealistic, looking for this, 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 and this. Can you step in and talk to her? We do that all. The yeah, time. but I think you'd you have that with have your teaching specific. association that was local, without the leverage and, and all the other incentives for self-interest and selfish interest. It, 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 when you have a selfish interest at your fingertips, it's hard not to use it, and that's which what unions do. Which selfish interest would you say the um, teachers have? It, all the things you want. You want to make sure you, you don't have to stay 15 minutes over, which most of you do, but I've heard teachers really cry, and my kids tell me, boy, they have a fit, they just leave. They won't stay a minute long. I, I know most of you do, and so I appreciate most, most of you. But see, you're, you're, so you're saying changing all it to and, you, and, and you don't need a union because you're already going to do the right thing. No, but we have no guarantee that our. Oh, you don't trust the administration. I don't. Okay. You well, I what? don't trust the union. I'll, so tell, there I'll, we are. I'll tell you why, Mr. Pepper, <laughs> because my husband works for the Fish and Game. He's been there for 27 years. He has a, a bachelor's degree. He runs the entire hatchery, and he makes less than I do. There's no. They, they run a merit program. And he was always had great evaluations. He is amazingly respected by the people in his field. But his boss, there's not a good relationship there. So he is the lowest paid man. See, there's no protection for him. He can quit, or he can against each other. But that's the same with everywhere else in the private sector. So what's the And is that a good thing? Yeah, it is. That means you get to be free. If everything's guaranteed, you no. give up your freedom for the guarantee. You're if you understand the system. The people we have are people to educate. We have all the children to educate. Anyway, I have to present a bill and resource. Well, thank you. But anyway, I was up front with you, and I respect you guys. I appreciate what you do. I, I hope and we I don't Because we are your, your constituents. I know that. There, and I have a lot of other constituents, and, and I have to and worry about all of them. And you've been hearing from them. And I do hear from them. Talk to our hospital. They are really concerned about this. Our hospital, which is one of the major employers I know. of our area, I realize. talk to I realize. any of the industry, our realtors in our town, they will tell you that their constituents I'm listening to constituents, well. and the majority of them don't agree with the union part. I, 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 could I you know, send I hear some from of those, could, could I have access to some of those letters? Because sure. I don't know who and, these people are.
I'll, I'll email you. Because I would really you, love to, to have a conversation about that. Uh, okay. Well, I, I respect your opinion. I just respectfully disagree with part of it. So, anyway.